In the days after Hurricane Harvey, we introduced you to Leslie Bradley of Rockport. She lost everything in the storm, but somehow she was having a difficult time connecting with all the disaster aid that was available. Tessa Barrera visited with Leslie to see how things are going for her now. The last time Chris Six News talked to Leslie Bradley, she was in and out of her car and hotel rooms. This is where she is now. You know, we still had to kind of get ping ponged around with FEMA, kind of go back and forth to try to figure that out. But while we were doing that, a lot of people in Rockport stepped up to help us. People like Gary and Samantha Weatrek, who provided Leslie and her family a place to live rent free, something you can tell Big Brother Caden appreciates. What did you think was going to happen after the hurricane? I didn't really know. I was pretty scared. I didn't really know what was going to happen. I didn't know where we were going to end up. Neighbors like Rockport realtor Kathy Tullis are providing moral support and a couple of gifts for Caden, Sean, and little Kiki. You could tell that her kids were her main focus. And then when we did get to meet her kids in person, they were just the cutest little things. Former server Leslie is a certified nurse's assistant. Kathy sees her potential. I'm helping her try to get a, at least a part-time job in, in the nursing field. Considering everything they've been through, things are slowly looking up for the Bradley Bunch. It's just starting from zero again, starting from ground level. Leslie got her FEMA check, but it comes with a whole new set of worries. I want to make sure that the, the money that I got for FEMA, that I, I make good choices with it that's going to help my future. For now, that future is rebuilding life in a place that has given her so much when she had so little. People at Rockport, they're stepping up and they're helping in every way they can, you know, and that's amazing. That's why I love it here. Tessa Barrera, Chris 6 News. We'll continue to follow Leslie on her journey to rebuild her life. You can also follow her story on our website, ChrisTV.com.